Hello and welcome back to Tomcat Bandit Plays Pokemon Crystal. In the last one, we fought our way to Ecarteek City and met Bill. Now we're heading back to Goldenrod City in order to get our Pokemon Eevee. And in order to do that, we must travel back to Goldenrod City. Uh oh, our pack is full. Oh well. Back to Golden Run City. What do we got here? We have a Hootoot. We already have a Hootoot. But you know what? It's probably going to growl at us. Hmm. It's a flying type, so we'll have to run. Uh oh. Very well. We'll have Bob kill it. Bruce could use a little bit of XP anyway. Yep, the hoot shoots growling at us again. Can nothing stop them from growling at us? Well, Rexos can. Bob, you can't be missing. You're making us look bad. Try again. You mean fail? Oh wait, that was their move. Never mind. Good job, Bob. Let's get out of here. On this route, you can see Stantler. Hopefully we'll see... Oh, speak of the devil. And he appears. Hello, Stantler. It's a female Stantler. Let's dizzy punch it. That's no fair. Bruce doesn't know any better. It's a dizzy punch. Maybe we'll confuse it. There we go. Man, it's like I'm voicing over an episode I've done before. And I'm not. I'm really not. Okay, let's throw a Pokeball. We'll call this, um, female Stantler. Man, if it was a male, we could call him Stanley. Or Stan Lee. Hmm. It's round balls, the, the round balls found on, fallen, on the fallen antlers. Hmm. The round balls found on the fallen antlers. Antlers can be ground into a powder that aids in sleeping. That's really disgusting. Yep, we have to give her a name. Stacy. There we go. That Antler's name is Stacy. Onward to the Goldenrod City. We'll go this way, it's a little bit quicker. And we do have somebody who knows cut. Which is Jeff. Thank you, Jeff. Oh, we've hit another Pokemon. What do we got? It's the Drowsy. Well, maybe we can catch this one. Mm. Don't want you in against him. Yeah, let's end up now. Haha, uh, we didn't use a move. Now use hypnosis. You mean didn't infect him? Uh oh. Now hypnosis is. We'll have to go double slap. Not bad. You can't do that. You've only already disabled me before. Okay, we can catch this drowsy. Come on, drowsy. You know you want to come with us.
Hooray, we caught a drowsy. It's a male drowsy. When it twitches its nose, it can tell where someone is sleeping and what the person is dreaming about. That's really weird. It's stalkerish. Alright, uh, let's name this drowsy Don. There we go. The drowsy name name is Don. Don the Don the drowsy. Of course, there has to be at least one more Pokemon encounter before we get to Goldenrod. And there's the Hootoot. Okay, let's run. Goodbye, Hootoot. We don't even want to talk to you. Okay, in order to get Eevee, we have to put a Pokemon away. And that Pokemon is going to be Doug. Unfortunately, Doug has outlived his usefulness. He does not yet know confusion. So, he is not necessary for our journey. Or the next gym. Although, the... There is a fighting gym over on Cinnabar Island. And a flying type wouldn't be too bad. Water types. And there is no fire gym. So we'll put away Mel. Goodbye, Mel. You did a good job. Hello, Nurse Joy. Can you heal our Pokemon again, please? We're gonna go pick up an Eevee. And we'll agree to make it into an Espeon. Because that is what we need to do. Espeon is the best. Sure, she'll be a glass cannon. But she'll be my glass cannon. Hello there, Belle. Oh, hi, Siri. Do us a favor and take this Eevee. If I have to, I'll take the Eevee. You twisted my arm. It came over when I was adjusting the time capsule. Someone has to take care of it. But I don't like being outside. I can count on you to play with it. Yeah, I'll play with it. I'll train it. Of course you can count on me, Belle. I will take good care of it. So long as it's a, so long as it's a female. And there she is. Hmm. I like to call Evie's Eve. Well, since she's going to be used mainly for breeding, we will call her Eve. Because we are going to use her to breed another female that knows bite. Unless she knows bite. Does Eve know bite? Ooh, level 20. Well. Growl, sand attack, and tackle. No, we're going to definitely use her for breeding. So let's go see if we can catch a snubble at night. A male snubble, to be exact. They should know bite at the levels over here. Snubbles. Snubbles? Snubbles. Everybody's avoiding me today in this tall grass. You would think Snubbles would like to mate with a beautiful Eevee. It's an Abra. We're gonna chuck a great ball at it. What happened to all my great balls? Oh well, questions for later. Oh well. If we call Bill up, we should be able to switch our um, box from here. Well, 
Well, apparently not. So, let's go back to Goldenrod. Whoa. What the heck was that? That... It's really weird. That... Okay. I am going to... Get over here. Change the box. Save the game. And off screen, I shall cut, catch a stubble in which to breed with my new Eevee. And back up my save data on another Pokemon cart. Or a um, Pokemon save cart that I've had since forever. It still works, actually. So, I will see you in the next episode. And... We shall have a hatched Eevee that knows bite, hopefully. If not, we will have a hatched Eevee that's going to get pampered at the hair salon like nobody's business for weeks on end. And man, I don't know why the N64 is lagging, but it is. I've never had this trouble before. Well, as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. If you enjoyed watching this video, it, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.